A letter of my name is Mr. Smart Anki. Welcome back to my let's play of Shogun 2 of the Hojo on Legendary Difficulty. So last time we left off, we probably did stuff. I don't know exactly. It's been a few days. Uh, anyway, so what we were doing was uh, I was going to send this army over to the Hoda territory, Sado, so we could take that. Um, we also had a bunch of level ups last time that I need to not forget to do, so I'll do them first. That one's not as important, but this one over here in Izu, we have both the Monk and the Metsuke, and this Metsuke is about to make me a whole heap of money. Sadly, he didn't get anything better there, but uh, that's still pretty good. And this Monk is going to get that and that, and then we're going to go for converting provinces, I guess. Uh, cats, that's alright. I'll take Wise Elder though. Right, um... So I think I was gonna put these archers in here. So let's do that, and then I suppose we'll uh, replace three of the oh, shittier archers. And I'll just disband them right away, I'm thinking. There's no need to keep them for now. It's costing us money. Uh, so, again, it's been like I'm still playing several campaigns at the same time, so I need to have a look at everything that I'm doing. Um, is there any reason for me to make this here? I guess I made a Buddhist temple because I had an extra slot because I want this to be a castle. <clears throat> but I was just going to make monks. Do I already have five monks or no? Uh, maybe. I have one, two, three, four monks. But I guess I don't have a fifth uh, finger magic. So I suppose, yeah. Anyway, so this guy needs to go somewhere too. Uh, so I guess we're going to send him down here towards Sagami. Um, and then besides that, I think we've got all of our agents uh, doing something. I don't know why this guy is sitting in Itachi, so let's send them this way as well. Show them in an army, because why not? Um, and we have a ninja sitting here too, but he can stay there. He's giving me a little bit of vision and stuff. Right, I was going to send a ninja down this way though, so I guess that's going to be him. Because uh, I want to make sure the... Honma didn't already sent an army over here and it's just like landed here and it's now moving this way or something. Are they even, uh, let me see what their relation is with the Takeda. They are, they are at war so it could happen that they land an army here and then move it through to my territories. There's definitely a possibility there. Um, so we're gonna keep an eye on that for now. This channel is level 3. Are these both level... yep. Or leveled up I mean. Um, Okay, so let me just, before I do anything, I want to make sure I've got everything readied up that I was going to do this turn. It seems that I've got units queued up over here. These units were just done, so I need to queue up some more, so I may as well just queue up the next ones. Because we were going to have 10 archers, I remember. It was going to take a while before all of them were going to be done for each army. Because um, all of these are going to get replaced by these archers until we can make the better units, which we are working on right now. I talked about fire in five turns, but it's going to take 37 turns total before we can actually make the gunsmith and the upgraded version of that. So it's uh, it's going to be a while before that happens, and the gunsmith doesn't give us anything. I could put some, um, or I could I could upgrade this to a uh, powder maker once we get that uh, attack by fire, which will allow us to make the Hojo fire projecting mangonels, but. I don't. I mean, I, I probably won't have a few of them, but the, it's it, it makes my armies move so much slower. And maybe I'll just make like four. But you know, for like four of them, I could have four uh, bow warrior monks, which is so amazing. And having four of these is not that amazing, because I couldn't even use them in every single situation. Um, I mean, I was gonna make two, I think. But I don't think I'm even gonna do that. It's just annoying because, you know, we're playing as the Hoja. I want to make the siege engine things, but it's gonna take a long, long time before we can even do that. Right, so this is nine ships. Uh, we do have two more ships over here, which will uh, go uh, go into the same Navy. Is this completely repaired? No, it's not. So there's two ships there that aren't completely repaired, but eh, whatever. Right, so you guys are gonna go in here, and this army is gonna go in there. Right, and we're just going to move as far as possible. And I'll move you up oh, in there. And I'll move him just nearby. There's no need to not give the extra ship or use the extra ships as protection as well. And I'm going to send them around, both for exploration and I want to take that. So 
if there's nothing there we'll go ahead and take it if there is something there then um, at least we'll know about it right so we moved all of our armies and shit um, right um, okay, so yeah, we've got everything queued up. That's that's the most important thing. Was I gonna queue anything up else after this? Um, so I've got the first army is ready. The second army, um, well, these are gonna replace the men in the second army. So I guess I would want another. Um, I would want the third army as well. I don't know if I said I was gonna do that or not, but um, I guess we'll we'll just start working on that. So we want four more of them, and then four more katanas as well. Okay, um, and then we want 30 archers, well, 24 more so far, so yeah, it's going to be a while. And I think I said I wasn't going to move until I had all them ready. Uh, so we have six predicted food. We are playing a legendary, so we're going to take a lot of places that already have, like, a fortress and stuff. So I don't want to waste too much food but uh, anymore, but I would like to get some merchant guilds, especially in our... Um, in the places that we have, or that are worth a lot of money. Yagi is actually the top one right now, so I definitely want to get one there. Could even get that, but that's, extra, uh, that's only an extra 100 health, uh, wealth, so it's not really worth it. Then Izu, uh, Musashi. Oh yeah, I'll make a rice exchange there. Although, I don't think I'm going to do it here. <coughs> well, I, even can't, I can't even do it there, because it's uh, I also don't think I'll bother. I'll make it in Musashi though. Yeah. So the merchant guild's a thousand, right? Yeah, that's pretty good. Um, <clears throat> okay. So, how many generals do we have in the army over here? Is that just the one or two? It is two as well, right? So we have, we have six generals then. Two, four, six. Here we do. Okay, cool. Right. I think I, uh, I'm up to speed again. I mean, I yeah. I could upgrade this as well and then make a... Uh, suck it in, but that would be another food for just a, a hundred extra or two hundred extra wealth. I don't think that's worth it because that's not a town that's going to be our, one of my most wealthiest for a long time. Fukushima is going to become one. Although they already have a, I already have a rice exchange and a suck it in, and it's not even that high. But Fukushima is usually pretty good. Um, Ugo is alright as well with the stoneworks, uh, but mostly it's going to be Owari and Omi once we get there. They're, those are both really good for money as well. And of course these uh, three right here, especially these two, but that's never going to happen. Like those are going to be the last provinces we take. Um, right, so yeah, let's end the turn I think. Any diplomacy? I'm sure we've already tried this several times. And they didn't want it anymore. Homa, Takiyama, or at war. I did not see. Okay. Don't know exactly what's going on with the Takiyama. I don't remember if they had anything sending out or if they were sending over an army or anything like that, but <sighs> anyway, if you're watching this, a few more days until Attila. It's uh, gonna be exciting. Some of the YouTubers already have their copy, of course. I'm kinda jealous. Mostly because I want, oh well, partially because I want to play it myself, and but mostly because, like, they're getting all the views and I'm not, because they already have a copy. It's unfair. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm still excited. I can't wait. Well, I can't wait. I'm, I wasn't, I'm not as excited as I was for Rome 2. I was so damn excited for that game and it was such a disappointment. Uh, alright. I get. I wonder if they just came off of there. <laughs> we just defeated them with our two trade ships. Let's find out right away. Oh crap. I never rotate the camera. I hate rotating the camera. I think it's it's fine now. Alright, it's over here actually. Uh, yeah. Oh, there's a one Takeda ship on there. God damn it. <laughs> That's such a joke. Why couldn't they take out this ship first? They probably were just defeated by it actually. I think I might be one turn too late. Another Sunborn. Not sure if he'll uh, oversee battle though. Uh, right, so you're gonna go in there, you're gonna go in there. Our ninja has been detected. That doesn't matter. Okay. What is a full stack uh, Takeda army? What's going on here? Okay. Some more trade ships were built. I will continue making them, because it's only a matter of time before we get that. So let 
to queue up the rest of them. And I mean, even if we don't get it, it's not we're not paying that much for it. For the upkeep, I mean. Right, so that's gonna take like yeah, a few turns before we get there, like five, six, seven turns or so. But I mean, at least we're going. Honestly, we probably would have been fast. No, because we were yeah, we were over here. Never mind. I mean, well, actually, yeah, no, eh. I was gonna say maybe we would have been faster sending the army over here and then getting on here, but we don't actually have a port there for one, so we couldn't have made ships anyway. And this one doesn't belong to us either. Right, so he's gonna hang around here. Um. So we've got to send over some more units. Right. So these are queued up, and then it's going to be four more katanas after that, and that'll be the third army done as well. Um, let's get rid of these three as well. Our income's still good, but we don't need these units here. Actually, let's get rid of these four as well, why not? May as well uh, start getting rid of somebody upkeep if we don't have to pay for it. I mean, we, we're still not a threat, uh, or um, there's no threat here for going to war, so... However, the uh, Ikwiki have taken more provinces once again. So, they lost everything up here to the Takeda, and the Takeda have also taken Omi. Um, and they still got their two provinces here, Iga and Yamato, and they now own uh, Awari and Mino. So they own four provinces. That's Hatano, yeah. Right. We still have to make sure, though, uh, although it's, it's going to be tough, I want to make sure I attack the Oda before they die. Because if we don't, then they're... There's no way we're going to be able to go to war with the Takeda. Because the Takeda, I, I believe they were allied, right? I think that was the whole... Yeah, they're allied. They actually won an alliance with me didn't, as well, didn't they? So they're allied. Um, and we're allied with the Takeda. But if we attack the Oda, then there's a 99% chance the Takeda will join the Oda. Um, and obviously break the alliance at the same time. So we want to we want to make sure that we, c we can... Uh, that, the, that the Oda are still alive by the time that we need to... Well, no. We just need to make sure we attack the Oda before they die. Because otherwise we have no way of getting the Takeda to declare war on me rather than me declaring war on them. So, this army that's going to take Sado is going to like be right there or something so we can besiege them right away once that happens. And then I want my second army to attack the uh, Suruga so that we go to war. And then my third army is going to have to attack Kai or something. It's gonna be tough, because we still need an army to be over here and take Ugo as well. So actually, yeah, I didn't even realize that that's gonna be pretty annoying. Or maybe you should have made an army of the, all the units, uh, the, the Ashigaru units, but... Fuck it, we'll see how that works out. Um, I could always send my third army up, or my second, no, my third army up there, my second army here, and an army from Sado is gonna go there. Or something, I don't fucking know. Anyway, for now, there's nothing gonna change there, I'm sure. Four turns till attack by fire, which doesn't change anything. I don't know why I just checked that again. Who am I actually trading with right now? Takeda, Oda, and Takoka. Yeah, we got rid of that. Well, both those trades. That's going to cost me quite a bit as well. Probably going to have some kind of money issues by the time that happens because we're, we're about to get into a whole lot more upkeep costs as well. Uh, but we are going to get Seda, which is a good money making bronze as well. So, Speaking of which, I, sh which I should get a. Metsuke over there. The one that's sitting in Kazuke or something. Or whatever that province is over there. Kazusa. We need to have an, uh, the. I, I believe we have a Metsuke anyway. I'm not sure. Whatever. Anyway, the, the one in the, the lowest or, or least wealthiest province. We need to send him out towards Sado. And then I'll bring him over. I guess that will uh, bring me bring in uh, a decent amount of money as well. Takiyama. All right. Let's increase the rank. That could be a level four. That'd be pretty good. Yes, it is. Awesome. Does this guy already have? Yeah, he does. So there's another one. Though. Is it that one? That is that one. Okay, this guy's a legend right here. He's one of the best. He shouldn't be sitting in this shitty province. Because he's got... Um, 10 plus overseeing times. This guy's level 4, he's only got 9. 
That's what I mean. Like the big difference right there. So more bow warrior monks are done. Some more trade ships are done. Get them all in there. Not accidentally click the uh, attack button. That'd be pretty sad. Right. Let's keep you guys moving too. I should just like bring them over here in one swoop. May as well. Oh God. Never even noticed how slow the camera is when you need it to be. Oh, actually, yeah, if you go to border and it's faster, but whatever. Yeah. Like that should be good. Um, right. What else have we got to do? We made some more units. You guys get in there. Okay, so that's already a pretty good army. But, I mean, there's four slots left. That's going to be the remaining archers. And even if I did make the uh, fire projecting mongrels, I still have to make them here. And I, f I think they actually take three turns to make as well, so it would just take longer to make them as well. Besides that, they're not as good. It's just, it's not worth it. Um. So we got one more. Yep, you need to go in there. I mean, he doesn't actually part of this army, but he's going to be uh, the next army, right? And then we have uh, right. So agents. Okay, we got one in Itachi. That's the lowest province, I think, that we have money making or money wise, yeah. So we take him over to Sado. But it's still gonna take a, a little bit before we actually get to do that. It's probably worth putting this guy in a bigger money making province like Izu though. Sadly we can't quite reach it in one turn. Hey. And then we'll put this guy in Musashi, and then we'll probably send him over to um, to there, and we'll put this guy into Musashi instead. Right, um, what level is this fellow right here? Because, oh we got two in here, right. One of them is three turns away from leveling, this guy's a little bit longer away from leveling. I need to have to level up soon, because Mus Miyagi is my biggest money make province right now. It's definitely worth it to have that make more money. Um, right. So our navy is on the way. Uh, yeah, you're gonna hang around here to see if Sado or if the Homa land an army. And um, besides that, there's not much else we can do. So let's. Well, we can queue up a few more units here. Unimportant, but necessary in the long run. Ah, more trades opened up somehow. Okay, they will take trade, and Ikuiki will take trade as well. Oh, they're down to two provinces again now. I they actually won't take trade. I will listen to what you say, but it had better be good. How good? That's not very good. That is not very good at all. Um, I'll still take it. Mm, there's still an open slot as well. I don't know what happened. What? Which gave us more access to trade. But no one will actually want or wants trade anyway, so. I Stupid Tatakiyama. Why do you want war so badly? Huh? Um. Alright, he's my commissioner for finance. Yeah, okay. I was just gonna say, like, he. It would be worth putting him in, like, the most expensive army, but he is, so. Uh, we leveled this guy up already. Right, okay. Um, so we're, we're actually losing a bit of money this turn. You'll see 3,600, 1,700, yeah. That's just from the two Metskis not being in our town anymore. You can see how, how massive a deal that really is. Okay, you're not very good at assassination. Actually, I need. He's only level 2. I kind of like him to level up a little bit more, but. Um, okay. This guy, does he need to be here still? Eight. No, he doesn't. Let's start sending him down. Actually, no, let's have him explore over in Ugo. See what we can see there. It might be worth um, having a rebellion take that town. Just so we don't have to worry about like when we take that. We can just take it in the end of the game, basically. So that we're not like... Oh, well. There you go. Now we know what was there. I wonder if they just made those units there, or if they left those units from after they took it. I don't remember what happened there. It's all been so long ago. Normally I record, like when I record legendary campaigns, I usually record like 3 or 4 hours on one, on one evening or something. 
but with this one for some reason I'm just recording like one episode every few days so I'm, I'm every time I record I'm like behind no best show you idiots uh, oh god damn it okay well it's gonna be a lot of Christianity to deal with in the end let's hope they don't get too big okay. right and they'll keep moving on their own so what can you see here 23% chance. I can have level 4 as well. Maybe that one. He's not gonna level up for a while. I don't think this is gonna work. Ever. 23% chance. That's so bad. What have they got here? Okay. At least we know there's nothing here now. I mean, if th these units are gonna move through and they're gonna be like right here by the time that we actually attack them, so that's fine. Uh, okay, so my army or my units are gonna move through. We made some more Naginata dudes. Go in that army so I don't get them confused. And right, so that's all of the remainder of the units queued up. And archers. Right, oh my god, my income 812. Okay, how's it now? 2399, that's still pretty bad though. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna be able to afford three of the armies. Like, in, to its completion. I mean, I know we're gonna get rid of a lot of these units, but they're also gonna get replaced. This entire army is basically gonna go, actually. This is all gonna get replaced. But, I mean, all gonna get replaced by more expensive units. Hmm. That's uh, possibly quite problematic. I mean, we're five units away from them being done. That's about a thousand, twelve hundred and fifty or so, thirteen hundred. But these guys are two fifty each, basically, and I still need like I don't know how many more. I haven't even got the first army done. One more for the first army, and then twenty more. Twenty, yeah, twenty-one more, basically now. So that total, that will be about 5,000. There's no way I can afford that. The math has been done. So I'm going to have to do this with two armies. Well, no, I, I mean, I could still have three armies. I just, one of the armies would be this army right here. But we have the third army's melee, so I guess I could replace the melee in this army. Eh, it's just weird. We're going to have like three and a half armies, basically, where we only want three. At least the first army's archers are going to be done. This entire army is going to be done. And then we'll make a few more of those archers. And I guess we'll just have to deal with that. Okay, so... Our ships are going to arrive in 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. In about 6 turns, we're going to take that. So I should start moving my Metsuke in a, in a turn or two as well. Which is also going to cost me some money. But at least this guy doesn't make me too much. Actually, it's going to be this guy that starts moving in it. I guess I, yeah, I moved in this turn, and I? Right. Um, yeah, income is pretty weak right now. Welcome. Oh, they'll take trade. Okay. I'm here to listen and to seek a worthy outcome to our discussions. They won't pay me for it, though. Or at least not much. All right, I'll still tra take trade. That's fine. Anyone else change their minds yet? No. Just well, scab it, why not? Okay, income is up to 2,500. That didn't really make much of a difference, did it? God, I feel like these ships are moving less far than they used to or something. I feel like normally you move much further than that. I don't know. That's weird. What are you guys doing? Okay, they're moving through. I was going to say, they were just standing there for a minute. It's kind of odd. Also fun is the Chesukabe having a foothold on the mainland. It doesn't happen very often. I'm wondering if the Ikuiki are going to die any time. I mean, I think we... Rem I remember they had some pretty strong armies there. But... I don't know if they still have those. Because they only have two provinces. Uh, it, okay, well our trade with them is gone again. Even though they didn't lose any provinces. Made some more bow warrior monksies. These guys are done. Alright, so this army is one unit away from being full, and then it's like the best it's ever gonna be. 
And wait, one more Naginata. That's the last of the Naginata. Just gonna go in there. Okay, so. Um, okay, if I make this, then I'll have six more units. And I should be able to afford that, I think. Oh, I can't believe we just haven't got this fucking trade route right here. That'll, that'll give me a lot of money as well when we can get that. But we also lose all of our trade with the Takeda and such, so... We're gonna have a big issue. <clears throat> Very big issue. Um, we, just, we need to hold out for a few more... I mean, we, we, we can still afford it for now. We need to hold out for a little bit longer until we take Seido, and then we can start attacking that Takeda on several fronts. Or at least that uh, Oda and then Takeda with them. On several fronts. Because we, we need these units to be away from there. We need uh, this army in Sado needs to be like here, and they would have this this stack would be near have to be nearby as well. Okay, speaking of which, I'm gonna start moving the replacement units this way. Uh, yep. Yeah. Oh. Uh, I'll take that monk with. So they can you can speed up the movement a little bit. I may as well take a ninja whiff as well. This guy. Right. Um, so they're going to be replacement melee for this army. They're going to over or they're going to take over these six and I guess two more of these units as well. And then we'll have four Yadashigaru and six archers. That's that's fine. So the first army is going to be complete. The second army is going to be incomplete. It's going to have yeah, all its infantry, but not all of its ranged. It's going to have uh, six ranged units. So it's basically missing four units. That's fine, I guess. We can deal with that. And then, yeah, I mean, yeah, that's that's fine. We can easily deal with that. Oh, this army moved. Where did it go? Let's uh, assume it went this way. Okay, there it is. Alright, that's good to know. Oh, they're losing stuff to the Atakiyama. I guess that's what's going on. They're probably going to take that right back, though. I really doubt the Atakiyama have got a stack that can deal with this army right there. Um, okay. Hey, Quickie, you want to trade again? Nope, didn't think so. You guys change your mind yet? Nope. I know it happens at some point, or at least it can happen at some point that they change their mind, so I'm just gonna keep trying whenever I remember to do so. Um, one turn until attack by fire, but it doesn't really help us. Um, there's nothing really that improves our income either. Uh, I mean, Chenindo a little bit, but it's 15 turns, and just, I don't, I can't really be bothered going for that anyway, because it's 15 turns. It's just, it's not that good. Um, and I just, I really want to go for gunpowder. And it doesn't even improve my income by that much or anything. Like, usually by that time, you'll have the realm divide happen. So, the extra income that you get from the trade is going to be um, unimportant. Because you've got... Oh, what the hell? Are you? Okay. Yeah, they took that town back already. The extra in income that you get from the trade is going to be neglected because you're not trading anymore. Because there's a realm divide going on. So... It's pointless. It's just, I mean, the a extra accuracy is good. I think I went for it when I played as the uh, just Kabe. It'll be worth getting it with this clan as well, because I'm going to have mostly ranged units as well, but still. Well, that's a good one, yes. Uh, no, we don't want that. Yep. That's this guy to level up now. Awesome. He's going to start making me a little bit more money. Uh, damn it, that's the wrong one. I thought it was the right one. Right, so let's see our income now. We should have gotten it up by a few hundred, I reckon. 1327, 1671. Yep, that's basically an extra unit right there. Okay, so these two units, so one of them. There you go, and then the last two are being made. Sisuma. Actually, one of you is going in there. The other two are going in there. You guys are going to move this way. Oh, and I guess you can take the uh, Metsuke with you as well. 
So that would be... This one's gonna go into touch... No, wait, what? No, he was gonna go with... Yeah, we're gonna lose a little bit of income. Actually, quite a bit of income right now. Um, I could also take this guy that's sitting in here. Although... No, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that. So we'll send him up by himself this way. That will cost me a little bit as well, but not as much. Because we've got two... We had two there anyway. Uh, yeah, down to 1,384. So we basically didn't go up any, uh, anything this turn, but we also didn't go down too much. Right, do I feel safe enough to go through Takeda to lands? I think I do. Uh, it doesn't actually make me that much faster, but I'll do it anyway, because then I can land, or I can get all the ships right there. Okay. Um, right. Uh, anything else? Rice exchange is done. That should increase my income a little bit as well. Weren't we making one here too? That's not done next turn, okay. Then we, weren't we making one here too? Yeah, that's also done next turn, right? That'll also increase my income a little bit. Just a tiny bit. That's still terrible, okay. Uh, in that case, is well, I guess we'll keep him for exploration around here. Just to know if they're making anything else. I don't know why they would be, because I, I mean, technically I could just make like two units to take Ugo with. I think that's probably the best idea. I think I'll start doing that now. I'll make some Yari Ashigaru. Just like four. We've got a stronghold. Uh, I could just do it with like only art. No. Nah. It's annoying. If I make them, it'll take too damn long. Yeah, I'll, okay, I'll just use like four. Yeah, I actually got a five, whatever. Um, as long as I don't have to auto resolve it, it's fine. Well, actually, as long as I don't have to fight it, it's fine. Okay, where is that army continuing on this way? It is, good. Alright, the further it gets away from the front line towards me, the better. Because they have an army sitting in there. I kind of want to know what that is, actually. Uh, okay, nothing too bad. Because, yeah, they have an army there, so we have to have one army deal with that. That's probably going to be our smaller army. They have a smaller army, we have a smaller army, that's fine. Uh, this main army... Actually, I'll take the main army to deal with that. The smaller army goes to take Saruga. That That's what initiates the war. This army takes Achigo. And then it starts going west towards that army, which means Kazuke is going to be... Uh, well, the army that takes Kai is going to go this way, take Kazuke, and then it's going to go west. Um, and we, we're going to have a few units just taking this. Oh, and I've got the, if I've got the monk in this army, that will actually improve the uh, morale, which is good. Because that's the one thing I'm worried about. If I do have to fight it, morale is going to be an issue. Okay, good. I think we've got everything... Uh, right, we've got the general plan worked out. Next turn we're going to lose a lot of income. We're gonna start going bankrupt in a few turns, I think, if we keep this up. Um, I'm assuming we already... yeah, it's him, right? I, mean, it's, I don't know what I'm doing. Five elements, what did I actually do again? Oh, right, yeah. Shite increases the influence. It takes freaking 13 turns to get that as well. Probably more if you don't have, because we already have 17% bonus, so maybe 14 turns. It's just so fucking bad. Uh, okay, one more turn to try this shit out. Trade, please. Money. Money for me. No. Okay. You want you want peace yet? Oh. Speak your insolence. My insolence. I will never speak my insolence. Here. Wait, do we just go into attrition? Oh, you. Twat! What the hell? Oh, that's really fucking stupid. This is why I barely ever use that. No, sorry, mate. I'm about to attack you. I'm not going to go into an alliance with you. Wait, did I just take out the Equiki? I think the Echo might be dead. They're still going west, though, which is great. Yeah, we're goddamn taking a treasure. I think it's because of that one ship that was sitting there. That's really freaking annoying. That's, that's going to cost us for both our ships and our men. And we need we need those men. Relatively badly. Uh, Compassion of Buddha. 
Uh, I'll take it. Just because I don't want to upset the guards and shit. Attrition. 100 or 268 men lost. It's fucking stupid. Right. We can land next turn. This is not attrition, right? Let me just make sure. Okay. Looks like a small navy there. Oh, wait. Is there an army on that navy? There is. Oh, my God. Is, I wonder if Sado is completely open for the taking. Should be able to see with this ship right here. No, there's still an army in there. Okay. Oh, wow. They have fireball for us. Can you use my strength against me? Even though I don't even use my strength? Uh, okay. Keep following that army. I want to see where it's going. Although I do actually want him. Well, actually, no. Yeah. Eh, eh, eh. I, I, I do want him back at some point. Oh, no. He's in a level 2 guy. I thought I sent a level 4 guy over there. Enemy ninja, you say. That's not an enemy ninja. But since this guy's a high level. And he could do with the experience. Yeah, now I brought him 15 XP. That's five turns closer to leveling up. Because he needs to go on the ship the turn after next. Great climate story, that's the equity. So, made our last of the boar warrior monks that we're going to be making for now. We can upgrade this as well. I didn't even realize that, but I'll go ahead and do that. And we'll send these guys this way. So, you were going to go in here. Uh, that unit's right there. You're going to go in there. You guys are going to go in there as well. And then these three are going to go in there too. And then we're making one more. Which I guess I'll keep making. Oh god, I really want more of them. I can't afford more. Um, do I cancel him? I mean, it's an extra unit, but yeah, fuck it, I'll keep making it. So that'll be the sixth one. Okay, you guys keep moving through towards Achigo. They're actually, they're not even going on a ship. What the hell was I thinking? They're going to wait here for this army to come back over here. What have you got in Sado, by the way? Gold mining complex, siege engineers workshop. Okay, so we do need to make the market there. And regular roads, but that doesn't matter. The rest is fine. They got this upgraded. No, oh, this needs to be upgraded too. Um, What else? We made the first Yari Ashikaru. Oh man, we have four more trade ships over here as well. Yeah, they're going to take this the moment we, we go to war. And the other navy is probably going to go back there to protect it as well. Um, merchant guilds are done. Right, that definitely see a little boost in income. Because we were about to lose a lot that turn. Or we were, we were losing a lot that turn. But we just got a little bit more again as well. Anything else that we can do? I don't think so. Trade, perhaps. Welcome. Nope. Why don't they take peace now that I'm like around the boar step? No. I, I think if I were to besiege them, they might take it. Right. Um, I am going to get rid of part of this army, so maybe I can make the rest of those archers. Am I going to get rid of part of this army now? I'm going to get rid of these guys. What I might do actually, since I can't afford the archers for this army anyway, I may as well just get rid of the shittier units and then... I don't, I'd better not though, because I mean, I, I kind of like to get rid of these katanas because they're costing the same as those other ones. And I'll just, yeah, I mean, I'll, yeah, I'll keep you actually got it. They're just as good. They're a good mainline. Yeah, it's fuck it. So I'll get rid of the katanas, which will save me a bunch of money, which means I can make more of these. But I'll still hold off on that for now. Because it's just, for now, it's too expensive anyway. I do want to four farm me at some point as well, but. Because I, I would even like to keep this army just as a, a separate army by itself, which is just going to, like, defend the behind the lines and stuff. But I can't really do that yet, so I just I can't afford it. Anyway, uh, without any further ado, 31 more turns for that. Okay. Let's keep going. Okay, I guess, yeah, he was just the one who was checking out what they had in Kai, right. This plan isn't even guaranteed, by the way. Decada might just say, we're not, I'm not going to join my war with any of you. But it's most likely that they'll join the defending clan, which would be the Oda. Oda are getting relatively strong as well now, actually. So this is definitely the time to attack them. But 
I think everything's gonna work out like just fine. We need a few turns to take that town, get everything settled. We need a few turns before the Yadi Ashikara are done so we can take that town. We need a few more turns for the last units to be recruited here. So everything is gonna work out just in time for the entire operation to be ready in one go because this is the second unit only. Oh, they're actually making units here now. See, that's something I wasn't quite expecting. That's bad in several ways. Because, for one, we need to defeat that army still. And two, if they go, if they move out before we take the town, then they could just go down here and take Ugo for, or Uzen, for example, and Miyagi, whatever they want to take. I could, however, bribe them. Not the settlement, but the units, if they were to come out. Uh, that's something I'll keep in mind in case that happens. Anyway. Uh, oh, they're sitting in a town, that's why we can't. Okay. Or that's why we can land the army right now. There we go, and it's summer, and that works out perfectly. Not sure. Oh my god, I've got at least four of those units. Three generals as well. I'm not sure if I can actually auto resolve this fight. If I can't, then I'll siege them out if I can. Great. I'm gonna leave my army right there, so that these guys can't get out of here. Although I think I'll send this one ship back this way. Because the Metsuke is gonna go on there. And you can actually do that this turn, but that might be a little bit dangerous. Let's just speed things up. Actually, I don't even know if I could, if he could. Um. Otherwise, he'll land. No, we're gonna. It doesn't matter. We'll take the town. Yeah. Okay. No, it's fine. I hope he doesn't land these units though. But if he does, I suppose we'll just have a big fight on our hands. That's fine either way. Uh, so yeah, we'll leave him right there. So next turn, we'll move this ship over here. Oh no, it'll take an extra turn, because we can't actually use this dock, but whatever. So in two turns, we'll have the Mets over there, and that's fine. Right. You guys are gonna go into this army. Uh, Ninja, you can go back in there. Okay. I wonder if they're actually still making units there or not. Okay. Do we actually have anything here? It would be fine if they did. It just means they have less units somewhere else. Um, I feel like one having one katana here would probably help out as well. It's just annoying though, it's gonna cost a few more turns to do. Can I not see what they've got in there? No. I can demoralize it or at least attempt to do so. Okay, one bow samurai. Probably the worst enemy to fight as a Yari Ashigaru army. Our income is definitely going down a lot, but we're not making that many units anymore now, so it's fine. We just got one more, which should be done next turn, I think. Yep. Um. Okay. Let's keep going. All right, we've got to move in mostly. Ah, and there's the full trade ship stack. I'd like to get my navy out of there, like out of where it is now, before we attack the Takeda. They just took Nota, which is actually not bad. This means, like, it's not another... It means that the Kiyama are now down to their one province over there in Ki. Which is good. Less places they can come from. Kind of wish that the Kiyama was a playable clan. I mean, I know you can download a mod that allows you to play any clan you want. But just because they, they have such an interesting starting position, they start with three provinces all over the place, or four. I think it's three, but might be four. Ninja increased the rank, that's fine. Uh, ninja detected. Right, well, he's gonna go back this way anyway. He's gonna go with this army. Okay, so can we take this in one turn? Uh, Alright. Yeah, that's fine. And the army that was sitting on the navy disappears. Perfect. So we'll fix that. We're gonna get rid of that. I wanna upgrade that, but uh, yeah, I can afford to do that. And the roads give us growth, so I want that too. Right, you go pick up this Matsuke. Oh, that doesn't actually take a full turn. Sweet. Well, in that case, that's uh, maybe because it's an allies province. It's kind of weird though. Oh, and you can get there in Wow, okay, that was a lot faster than I thought it would be. Um, right, so I still need to use a navy to get the army over here. Now I can 
get rid of some of the units, I think. We can make it on a ninja as well. May as well do that. What are you doing? Um, yeah, I mean, I may as well, right? Be a level one ninja, but... Can I make them anywhere? Yeah, I can make one here, right. Right, Holmar dead. You guys get in there. You start moving that way. Uh, you're waiting. You're still being built. They okay, still only two units. So at least it, it doesn't look like they're making a unit every. Oh no, it's because they're making uh, bow units. They're gonna take two turns um, to make each one. This province will be happy next turn. Great. I'll still wait in here. I'd rather start moving now. I mean, I can't land here this turn anyway. I may as well just do it next turn. Okay, so maybe next turn, but possibly the turn after would basically be already to uh, already to attack already. Okay, actually, before we do that, let's um, oh, let's merge some of these units. So we're gonna keep the five experienced ones, um, or as me as much as we can anyway. Oh crap, that's too much. Right, because yeah, we were gonna keep. Wait, I was going to keep four, right? Yeah, so, I, oh yeah, I was just going to get rid of the... Okay, right, so we got one that's a little bit too depleted. Uh, that's fine. And we can get rid of these six katanas, as much as it, as it pains me. Their experience and all that. But they're going to get replaced by these men right here. <sighs> so painful. Okay. And actually, yeah, working, waiting here for a turn is fine, because at least we'll replenish a little bit as well. This guy's going to level up in four turns. That's going to be really good. This is not our high money making province. You guys, I'm gonna land the army like right here, I guess. So I may as well. Or, no, I'll just land them right here. Why not? It's way better. So I'll leave them right there. Uh, Ninja increased the rank. Did I already deal with that? I don't think so. Nope. Nice. Another good sabotage ninja. Okay, so. The fuck are these roads? They haven't upgraded these goddamn roads yet, Suruga. That's stupid. Um, so you guys are gonna take that, and well, I'm still waiting for one unit. Well, fuck it, I'll still move my winner. So technically, next turn I'd be ready to go on the full-on attack, but we're not gonna do that yet. This army is gonna take Kai, so I may as well just move it over towards Kai. I should start preparing where I want my agents as well. I'll take an, a monk in this army and a ninja in this army. I have a ninja that is made there. A uh, monk, this monk can go in that army. Um, that's a Metsuke. That's a ninja, right? This ninja doesn't need to be here anymore. Actually, no, it's alright. We'll leave one ninja around there. Who else have we got? So we got one Metsuke there. We got two ninjas here. Okay, so. One of the ninjas is gonna sit in the army, the other one's gonna hang around here. For sabotage. This guy's only level 2 though, so I'll probably put him in the army as well. We got a monk sitting here. Right, use my exploration monk for the moment, although I want to use him on the front line at some point as well. And we only had four monks, didn't we? Yeah, okay, right. So we got a monk in each army and that monk right there. Okay, that's good. Um, oh, our income is pretty good as well. Again, because we just got rid of all those units, so I think I'm gonna recruit a few more actually. So I want four more for the second army, so I'll just make those four for now. Um, and the second army is probably just gonna sit in Suruga for a little bit anyway. I mean, like, yeah, once it's full, I'll start moving in that way up to Owari or maybe Mina. I'll probably Owari. Owari is owned by rebels. Cool, that's good. Um,. And the army from here is going to take a Chigo, and then it's going to go this way. The army that's going to take Kai is going to move over to uh, North Shinano, then Kazuke, and then move back again this way to South Shinano. Army up here is going to take these provinces around here. Okay, that's all covered. And then, oh right, we still need Fukushima. Frick. So this army is going to take Fukushima first, that's fine. And the army that's going to take this is probably just going to get disbanded. Um, if we can even take that. But uh, that should be fine, actually. We don't have to worry about the few units that are in there. Like I said, if they move out, I can bribe them. And if they stay in there, then I'll just siege them once I've got enough units. Unless they make a full stack right there, but I doubt they're going to continue that while I'm attacking them in every other spot. 
Okay. Uh, so yeah, we're nearly ready for the attack, but it's it's still gonna be a few turns before I actually do. I wanna get these units over there and all that. Uh, yeah. So anyway, any trading to be done, perhaps? Welcome. I wonder and what take would you ask no. of the? Okay. Still no trade. Hatakiyama, would you take peace just out of interest? Because now you're down to one province. Speak I still wouldn't carefully. take it. It's funny, because if they would have taken that, they may have taken a um, thingy magic as well. Yes, a thingy magic. A um, vassalage. Hey, it's okay now. How about you move uh, your. Um, one ship off the trade port or trade thingy. That'd be pretty cool. So I could take it. How about that? <sighs> but yeah, our 10 trade ships should be able to take on whatever one ship he has. Unless it's the black ship, but I highly doubt that. Plus, it would show on the little icon, it would show the black ship. So it's not the black ship. Uh, yeah, I'll take her. A loyal wife. Loyal wives. You are gonna. You can go in that army as well. Wait, hold on. Didn't we have a ninja in here? One, two, three, four, five. No, I guess not. Okay. I really thought I would put one in there. Oh, yeah. I'll put it in there. Um, right. So let's move this army over now. Replenished a little bit as well. That's good. So you guys are gonna go on there. And you're gonna land right there. And you guys get in there. There you go, full stack. And it's a pretty strong army. Even the four Yari Ashikaru, and even the archers because they have the experience and all that. So even that is pretty good. And uh, now you guys are gonna go up north once, well, next turn. So still not gonna attack next turn. I will wait until my ships are a little further that way, but then I think we could basically attack. Really, we can't can't quite quite reach that in one turn. That's a real bummer. I wonder if I could reach it from here. It would take two turns just to get there, though. <laughs> Why can't you upgrade your goddamn roads? Can I get any closer? Oh wait, can I? No, that's what I thought. I can't go any closer, can I? No, I'm just. Well, I mean, I could do it, move up my general. I guess we'll have to use that tactic. So I can move up to like right there and then move up my general to actually take the town. I mean, technically, we don't even have to take anything. We can just declare war on them. Only to have, be at war with the Takeda. That's the only objective, really. So, technically, we don't have to do anything. But. Anyway, did they make a third unit? It looks like it. Oh, a fourth one as well. Okay. So now they're definitely making a lot of shit. May as well keep using or getting experience on an army, why not? Um, okay, what else happened? Not much. Uh, right. There's not much else we can do once again. Unless they want trade. I'm gonna do that every single freaking time. I kind of want to attack them this turn, but it's not going to happen. Next episode is finally going to be stuff happening again, though. I bet you've all been waiting for that. Next episode is also going to be the last episode before Attila is released. I'll probably still continue this, uh, well, most of my Shogun 2 series on a regular, on the same regular basis. I'll probably just upload more, at least the first few weeks for Attila as well. But I'll I'll stick to the regular schedule for Shogun 2. I think I'm thinking of adding like an extra slot, an upload slot, on every day. But the first few days it probably is going to be like I only Attila or maybe only Attila and, and Shogun 2. But I'm probably gonna put all my other series on hold for a little bit. Ninja increase the rank. Cool. Just sitting in an army. Another sabotage one. That's great. Okay, so the powder maker is done. So we can now make those units. So is it? Okay, it's still only two turns, so it's not terrible, but I'm not going to make them. And these three units are done. 
And then it's just one more, and then this army is done as well. Uh, take two turns to get there. So it'll be like four more turns until that army is basically complete too. So I might actually just wait for that. Uh, and then we have a few more turns to make all the units here as well, I guess. No morale on those units. They're going to break so quickly. Okay, now they dislike me because they know I was that. I was uh, trying to demoralize them. Uh, sabotage attempts minus 20. Dishonoring treaties. I guess they were dishonorable because no one else says that about me. Interesting. They're still allied to the Oda. That's all that matters. Trade? Hmm? That was a trade. Well, I wonder if they take it if I, I pay do them. not wish to listen to you, but politics makes. Oh my God! They don't even want trade for four thousand. Idiots! You don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Um, are you upgrading your road yet? No. Oh, come on, make it easier for me to get there, man. Upgrade your infrastructure a little bit. What are you doing? Uh, how are we doing on this halfway there? Okay. Uh, is it still the same? Yes, it is. Okay. Alright, well, let's just go through another turn. Like I said, I think I'll wait a few more turns for those archers to be there as well. So at least we got three full armies. I'm just worried about the uh, situation up there. Because we can't keep up with their... Or every, uh, their... Um, what can hell? Unit recruitment. We can't keep up. They make more units than we do, even if their town is less upgraded. That's just how legendary works. But um, I do need to take that town. I think the longer we wait, the more we fall behind. So maybe I should just attack. Maybe I should not wait for my archers. I mean, the old archers will get there in a few turns anyway. Because now they've got six units, and we only have f five, and ours are weaker as well. And ours don't have the morale. Oh, wow, nothing happened this turn. Okay. Um, these three units are going to get there next turn. But then I still can't move the in range next turn either. So, let's do this. I don't even know if I can move right there. Um, shit, did I forget to move my navies? Oh, fucking hell, I have as well. It's the one thing I wanted to do is get my navies the hell out of here. Right, let's do this. Let's um, let's attack. I don't even know if we can get there. There is always a well. Yep, okay, to join them. Okay, so we can reach that. <laughs> Okay, now minus 10. Jeez, why is that so damn unhappy? Right, well, anyway, um. Start upgrading this town a little bit at least. I mean, the freaking road system. I put them in there. Back in there, there's no real need. I mean, a uh, monk, I guess we could keep an app in it anyway. Um. You guys are gonna take that. Oh, fuck. No, oh, it should be alright, actually. I just realized happiness is gonna be an issue here, but we have the monk, so he'll keep it happy. I could even make a sucker then, so that should be fine. Because this army's gonna have to go this way and take Fukushima, too. And we'll go right. Actually, we don't need any replenishment, so we'll just go as far as we can get. And you. Oh, crap, that one unit. No, he's not gonna be able to take this. Um. You're gonna go this way. Right, and you guys are going to wait one turn and then we'll start moving this way. Actually, no, fuck it, we'll start moving now. But only up to there, and then we're gonna wait for that unit and then we'll move on further. And you fellas are going to take, or well, not take, you're gonna besiege this because we can't resolve this, I don't think. No, I would not resolve that. 
but we will continue the siege here, and I think that's where the game put its last save. So, next turn, or next time, we're probably going to have to deal with this fight, and then lots of stuff's going to happen. We're going to take Fukushima and move back right away. Going to have to find a way to keep that town happy. This town should be fine. Six, uh, seven, eight, yeah. So we can be fine next turn right away if we get the monk in there. We're gonna, probably going to sit here, so we've got for a few turns, because it is super unhappy. Put my monk in there as well, though. Plus, I want these guys to catch up with possibly the last unit as well, which will be in the next turn. Um, oh, I can make another monk now, so let's go ahead and do that. We'll make one right here. Alright. Sparring towns. And... That one. Right, and also... Uh, I was going to say something, but I... Oh, right, I was going to... Normally I upgrade this to this one, so I get higher level Metzkeys, but there's no point in that now, since I already have level 3 Metzkeys and above. So I'm going to go for that one, to get the increased uh, rate at which all arts are mastered. Right, so now the only problem we ha might have is we don't know what they've got in Kazuke. I guess we'll check that out now. Nothing. Oh, one unit, actually. Let's see if we can sabotage it. Get some extra experience. Okay, actually, that didn't save, so it doesn't matter. Right, I was going to end the episode here anyway. So, for now, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I shall see you again next time when war will happen. We're going to start taking a lot of the provinces, and we're going to start marching east, marching east towards Kyoto. So, until then, thank you guys for watching, and goodbye.